Hi, I'm David Day, College and Career Coordinator at Pryor High School. This past year, we started an internship program at Pryor High School. With House Bill 2535, students can do an internship and receive credit as they work. This year, we had 10 students do an internship our first semester. In our second semester, we had 10 more students do internships. This past semester, for a total of 18, we had two students that got out of the program for other reasons. Uh, but we had two students do an internship with GRDA this year. We started off by reaching out to different companies in the park and GRDA was one of those companies. Originally I had contact with Dana Shrum through our summer enrichment program for our teachers and having her as a contact I, I talked to her about getting our students to do internships. Uh, after sitting down with Dana Shrum we figured out that GRDA can offer about 55 different career pathways for our students. Uh, and knowing that we're trying to align our students' career pathways with the availability of jobs at GRDA. This year we had two students that were interested in engineering, uh, Kira Weaver and Nolan Davis. Uh, both Kira and Nolan had worked one nine-week period with American Castings and one nine-week pe period with GRDA. Uh, they flipped so one could work at one site and one could work at another site to give them a better experience. Next year we have 40 students that are wanting to do internships already signed up in different, in different areas and we're looking at different avenues that GRDA can provide opportunities for these students. My name is Joe Foltz. Uh, I'm an engineer, electrical engineer, and with, engineer with Grand River Dam Authority and I was able to participate in the uh, Prior High School intern program where we had uh, two students come in for a couple hours each day for nine weeks. Uh, had a Kara Weaver uh, the second nine weeks and Nolan Davis the first nine weeks. And they got to sit and shadow me and doing some of my projects as far as uh, learning, learning about the, some of the computer software we use in the planning group for uh, running low flow studies and they also got to spend a little time with us uh, some of the other engineers in our group uh, that do system protection, um, transmission line planning, substation planning, and kind of got to shadow a few of those engineers uh, and to see kind of what our daily duties were. We also let them uh, spend a little time in our uh, operations group over at our uh, energy control center at Kerr and uh, I think it was uh, very beneficial for them. Both of them were uh, somewhat interested in engineering when they came and uh, I think they got a good idea of what, what we do on a daily basis and if they want to continue down that uh, career path. Uh, they were, uh, it was, in uh, my opinion, a very good program, beneficial for them and uh, it was enjoyable spending time with them each day. Hi, my name is Nolan Davis. I'm a senior at our high school. Uh, I interned at GRDA the first nine weeks and we looked, my favorite part about it was uh, probably the operate, when we went to Kerr and looked at their operations center, they used EMS program to uh, watch all their lines and stuff and they'd have different colors for each of their lines when they're out to show different problems and stuff. I thought that was interesting. I got to go to Tulsa to see their their building up there and meet some people up there and they were all really nice it was a good experience and we I went to the pump back and we learned about uh, the transformers and all the different parts in the transformers and how electricity flows and we went to a lot of the different substations in the industrial park and he showed me how all the parts work together and how the electricity flows through them and how it all works when I started, I was really looking at electrical engineering because, well, they make a lot of money and it's, they work inside, they get to sit in the air conditioning, it's not like, uh, it's not like some of the other jobs where you'd be outside all the time during the cold and summer heat and uh, I thought it would be a lot of fun doing it, but they work with a lot of the stuff on the computers. They don't get to go outside very much, so that's what kind of turned me away from it. Because I want to be outside some, or a little bit more than they are, but they're inside most of the time. My advice to future students would be to make the most of it and take it seriously. Don't mess around, and 
because you can learn a lot from this program and you should learn all you can so you know what you want to do or if you want to do that when you get into college so you don't waste time and money. My name is Kira Weaver. I'm a senior at Pryor High School and I was the second nine weeks intern at GRDA in the engineering department. I've been really interested in computers since I was little so having the opportunity to go and work with engineers and learn more about what I was interested in was really something I wanted to do so as soon as I heard this internship program was something that was available to me I went and I talked to whoever was necessary and I did what I could to be a part of it. This internship program has been really beneficial for me because it's really opened my eyes to all the different engineering opportunities and just everything that GRDA and just engineering in general has to offer for the community and for its engineers. I really enjoyed getting to see all the different jobs and roles that people get to play and learning about the power system and how it works. So when you flip a light switch, you don't know. You don't think about everything that happens behind the scenes of that. And so getting to learn about how electricity and power actually works was very interesting. And it's led me to consider pursuing a career in electrical engineering and in the power industry. And we'd definitely like to thank GRDA for providing this opportunities for our prior high school students. Thank you.